I know we only in March and I'm getting a little ahead of myself because 2Ks don't usually drop until September. But I just been thinking, what did 2K got planned for the PlayStation 4 version of 2K21? Because we already know they got to make two different games this year. PS4 version, then the PS5 version. Last time we had two games in one year was back on 2K14. The PlayStation 4 came out in November and it dropped alongside 2K14. This dropped with the PlayStation 4 because you need games to play. When a new console come out, people need games to play. And so game developers put their best foot forward, making it a release title next to the console. Here's the sports game. You're probably going to get a FIFA. You're probably going to get a Madden next to your PS5. Probably going to get, you know, a story game. I don't know what they got planned. I don't know what's coming out with PS5. You feel me? But that lets me think that they can't be doing too much for the PS4 version, though. 2K21 on PS4 probably not going to be nothing much. New park, new events, that's it. It's probably going to be the same game as 2K20. Just, you know, newer park, newer events, and that's all I can see them doing. They can't, there's no way they taking their time to make two different games. The last time they did this was 2K14. What changed from 2K13 to 2K14? They introduced a crew mode because everybody was asking for it. But we all know that the that the real version of 2K14 was the PlayStation 4 version. I'm you, but digital. We all know that. So with that being said, let's take a look back at 2K14 and even see how much improved from 13 to 14? Because I played 13 on the PS3, never played the 2K14 version on the PS3 because I knew there was no reason to get in it. That's how I'm kind of feeling right now, and that's what's making me do this because I am i don't know if I want 2K21 on PS4. This was the huge selling point of 2K14. This was it. This was what made people had to buy it for PS3. Crew Mode is back in NBA 2K14, and our community team-up members had the first opportunity to play the first full game of Crew Mode, and it was an exciting moment for them. I smell cap from a mile away. It means competition. Crew is bringing back competition. Really? I, I feel honored to be the one to tell you guys that Crew Mode is back. They hear us. Okay. Straight up community. If you want to win the game. <laughs> you see some the gamer. Straight up. He was like, straight up, <laughs> community. He don't believe none of it. This gives me something that I never got to experience in NBA 2K11. He's reading off a teleprompter. What is this? If you like competitive gaming, I promise you, you're going to love this game. Crew Mode has arrived. Crew Mode is back. You never thought it would come back, and now it is back. You hear that? Check. Crew Mode was back. That's what they was trying to sell us on, on the PS3 version of 2K14. For those of us that, that knew what Crew was, what was it? What was, what was Crew? Let's, let's find a video with Crew. Crew was like the Pro-Am is now. Custom jerseys, you couldn't customize the arena, but that was... In 2K10 you could, but 2K11 you couldn't customize the arena. But nonetheless, custom jerseys, four quarters... Pro-Am basketball. That's basically what crew was in 2K11. This was the first time you ever got to use something like this. And it was dope. We all loved it. You feel me? That's why people play Pro-Am now. Y'all know what it's like to play Pro-Am. It's fun. But this was the very first start of it. So, of course, this was mind-blowing and fun. And we wanted it back because it wasn't in 2K12. wasn't in 2K13. And so now they're telling us they brought this back in 2K14. First off, you can already tell the difference. We on the rooftop. For those of you that played 2K13, this is the same exact rooftop from 2K13. So this is, first off, it don't look anything like the crew that I know. You feel me? Maybe you can customize your jerseys. I don't know. I ain't play this game. You can, it look like you can customize your jerseys. But nonetheless, is this even four quarter basketball? Because I do not see a time limit in the bottom right. I do not see a time limit. Is this even four quarter basketball? This is 5v5, whatever in the world this is. I don't know what's going on. What would y'all even call this? This is 5v5 park at this point. I don't even know what to call this. This is 5v5 street basketball, and they over here talking about crew back. This don't look like no crew that I was playing at all. What do games go to? All right, we're, we're picking it up right here. Let's check it out. Let's see if this is four quarters. 
Because the video almost over. That's why I fast forward to the end of the video. This video 13 minutes long. And they talking about crew back. He pulling up for three. Bang. And that's, and that's game. See what I'm talking about, chat? When 2K tell you they doing something, they do it wrong. Never thought it would come back, and now it is back. Listen, listen, listen. I don't know what's going to happen with the PlayStation 4 version of 2K21, but based off past experiences, it ain't going to be what they tell us it is. They got all these YouTubers coming up to the studio talking about, hey, crew mode back, crew mode back. This ain't even close to it. What are you talking about? It was back. They gave them ones and twos. Game counts by ones and twos to 21. And y'all talking about crew mode back. How is that four quarter basketball inside an arena? Like, what are you talking about, bro? This is NBA 2K13.5. What is this? What is this? So I'm expecting 2K21 to not be anything exciting, at least on a PS4. Who knows what they got in store for the PlayStation 5, but PlayStation 4, 2K21, I don't know if I'm buying it. I make content on it, so I might buy it just for that reason. Like, I'm a YouTube. That's what got me iffy, even if I want to make YouTube videos on it. Because there's other games that's going to be dropping. We're going to see what else coming out with the PS5, so I don't even know. I might even play FIFA. I'm, I don't play FIFA often, so I might even play FIFA over 2K that. I don't know. We're, we're still trying to figure things out. I don't know. You get what I'm saying? So this is looking very iffy he for me. He did that for YouTube. Shout out to Ki Cool Kid Matrix. He did that for YouTube. Listen, man. 2K need to do something for YouTube. I don't know what they got going on. But let me know what y'all think about 2K21 on the PlayStation 4 down in the comments. Y'all think it's going to be okay? Y'all think it's going to be cool? Because I'm pretty sure they're all locked. They're all in on the PlayStation 5. Y'all know PS5 come out November, December this year. I don't know what to expect from this game, bro. I It seemed iffy. Y'all ain't even got to tell me no information on it. The game already seemed iffy. But let me know what y'all think down in the comments. If y'all enjoyed the video, leave a like. Hit that button that says subscribe to join the mob. While you at it, follow me on my social media. My Twitter, my Instagram, they both I-T-Z-R-E-A-S-E. -E. Ah, it's been your boy Reese in peace. You there?